What's going on everybody? This is Lee Kirby Dicko Comics here and in this video I'll be showing you guys a CGC versus PGX versus CBCS grading test grading the same exact book by all three different grading comic book companies. Now the reason why I did this, I bought this book originally graded by CGC. I knew immediately when I got it in in the mail and I seen the case that I was positively going to have it regraded by CBCS. But I thought in the meantime, before then, before actually handing the book off to CBCS, because I wanted to do on-site grading or at least hand it to them in person at a convention. Uh, in the meantime, I thought I'd crack it out, give a good look at it, do a video showing the insides, which I'll leave a link in the description box. You can go check out the interior of this book before it was graded. And in the meantime, though, I thought might as well grade it by PGX to see what they graded. Um, and what a book to do it to, Batman number one from 1940. Um, so, this book, I want to give you a good look at it so you guys can give your opinion of what you think the grade truly is because I tell you, after you see the results of what CGC, PGX, and CBCS graded this book, you'll, be, uh, you'll have different thoughts on the grade companies, I'll just say that. Uh, but anyway... Here's some good close-ups of the book so you can get an idea and give a, give a guess down below what you think the grade of this book is, what your unprofessional opinion is. All right. Alright, and now that you got a good look at the uh, book in the case here, really good uh, close up so you can see the condition. Um, this book was originally graded by CGC at a 5.5. So you can see right there, uh, it is a restored book and it did come back restored from all three grading comic book companies. Uh, this CGC company graded it with cream to off white pages. So again, 5.5 from CGC. PGX graded it in 8.0 with light tan to cream pages. So that's kind of interesting that CGC actually gave this book a better page quality than PGX. So that's kind of interesting though. 5.5 from CGC and an 8.0 from PGX. And this book, uh, the way I wanted it done was the final case I wanted this book to be kept in was to be a CBCS case. Their cases are by far the best in my opinion. Uh, they're super clear and um, the reason why I wanted to resubmit the Batman 1 from CGC's case is because not that I have a problem with CGC's old cases um, but it was they put it in a very large magazine size case where it literally stuck out like that much. Uh, I have no idea why they did that. Um, but it kind of ruined the display, so I wanted to get it regraded. And CBCS graded this book at a very nice 6.0. So, very nice in the middle of CGC's 5.5 and PGX's 8.0. So, you can see right there, same exact Batman number one. And CBCS graded this book with off white pages, so off white page quality. Um, what can I say about you know these grading companies? I honestly think the book is at least a 6.0, maybe a 6.5. Um, as far as PGX grading this book in 8.0, you 
you have to agree that the book does look like an 8.0. I mean, you look at the book, and PGX is one of those companies that doesn't tries not to downgrade for restoration. Okay, they they will note the restoration and they will say it's restored, but they try not to downgrade much like what CGC does. Uh, there's no way in hell this book is a 5.5. Um, CBCS giving it a 6.0, I think, is a pretty conservative grade. Um, again, the book looks like an 8.0 all day long, front and back, corners, spine, interior pages. Again, you can see a video of me flipping through this book. Uh, the links will be in the description box. Uh, but as far as what I think, I think CBCS is the most accurate of these three. Um, again, PGX grading it what the book looks like, CGC doing their typical uh, downgrade for restored books. Um, I think the page quality was definitely more off-white, um, maybe, maybe creamed off-white, uh, but definitely don't think it was light tan to cream pages, so PGX was definitely a lot harder on the page quality than all three. Um, but yeah, guys, that's, that was my uh, grading test, grading review of all three different grading companies pgx cbcs and cgc um you can take from this uh review these results what you want i in my opinion that's why i planned it out this way i will take cbcs of the three um definitely as far as uh cgc's new cases uh which that'll be a whole different video in itself but yeah, guys, that's going to be it for this video. Make sure to hit that like button down below if you enjoyed watching. Comment your thoughts down below. What you think of these results. What grading company do you prefer? Let me know down below. And if you haven't already, make sure to hit that subscribe button to see all my future comic book videos. And yeah, that's going to be all, guys. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video. That's all, folks.